Chapter 45 A Bad Teacher One of the worst of popular ideas is that we can learn by experience, and that experience is a great teacher. Nothing can be further from the truth. Experience is a very bad teacher. An alcoholic learns nothing by getting drunk, nor a gambler by losing, until they bring something other than the experience to the situation. Some bad experiences with men have turned many a woman into a man-hater, and bad experiences with women have made women-haters out of many men. Their experiences were false teachers. A bad experience with churches makes some people haters of Christianity. Has their experience given them any wisdom or insight? It is not experience that teaches us but the faith and character we bring to experience. Two people experiencing the same thing can come up with radically different conclusions because each brings a different outlook to the experience. It is not the experience, but the man and his faith that counts. If we overrate experience, we underrate faith and the man. Hence, it is that Solomon counsels Keep thy heart with all diligence, for out of it are the issues of life. Proverbs 4.23 The heart, the religious core of man's being, his faith and life, is the key, not experience. If a man's heart be regenerate, experience can then increase his wisdom and insight. However, if his heart is evil then experience will teach a man nothing but more evil. Experience in itself is not capable of being the teacher, and when men look to it for learning, they get only a bad teacher. Look at the world's experience since 1940. How much have men and nations learned from it? They still continue to repeat their old sins and errors, having learned nothing. Until the Spirit of God and His Word teach them wisdom, they will learn nothing. Therefore, Scripture counsels us, with all our experience and learning, get wisdom, get understanding, forget it not, neither decline from the words of my mouth. Proverbs 4, 5.